Morning folks. I'm at Anderson Marsh in Clear Lake, California on a hike. Well, more of a walk, if anything. Actually, I just had to turn around because the trail was flooded. Goes to show you why it's called a marsh. And I don't know the historical value of this of this park, but I've walked it before, and uh, it's a really nice park. Um, it's got nice trails. And um, plenty of nice scenery, as you can tell from the background. It's uh, mostly native grasslands and uh, oak trees. And uh, later on, we're gonna hit a marsh type area with your tulies and whatnot, your basic swampy vegetation. Um, I've seen two deer so far. Um, numerous birds that I'm not even in the position to name all but uh, but it's it's pretty good so it is Mother's Day Sunday and uh, after this I'm gonna head back to the Bay Area and uh, go see mom and then and then we'll take it from there but uh, but I've been wanting to come back to this trail I was out here about a year ago and um, I'm finally back here it's a really good trail and really the only reason I'm up here is because of that fire sprinkler job I've been telling you folks about so as you might have heard from my previous videos I um, met a gentleman that needed a fire sprinkler system installed and um, he came to our company and asked us if we could d design him a fire sprinkler system. So we did that. Mind you, this was about three years ago. And um, so now he asked me if I could help him install it. because as an owner builder you can do that so it's only 12 heads it's a little vacation home um, the guy keeps bees makes honey and uh, real good guy and uh, we got seven heads done yesterday so I figured I'd come back next weekend and finish it 
Now, the system requires a pump, and uh, he doesn't have it yet. No pump. They are, those things run about $2,000. So, he didn't get one yet, but he needs to real soon before his permit runs out. And this has been dragging on for about three years now. They're looking, well, can't really see it. But there was a rattlesnake warning sign posted. <laughs> so, this goes to show you the different kinds of wildlife you can find out here. So, so stay tuned. Moving on to a clearing. More of this wild grass type of vegetation. Truly wonderful to see such nature undisturbed. Look at that massive oak tree. Isn't that something? I'm just gonna have to back up to get it all into the frame. It's, it's immense. Must have been there for hundreds of years. And now the road splits, but uh, it looks like it dead ends at that marsh. So let's keep going straight. Now mind you, this is right off the freeway, or highway, however you want to call it. So, it doesn't, doesn't take much at all to come out here and enjoy this place. Entrance is free. That wouldn't matter, really. I mean, if you do have to pay, all you're doing is supporting these parks. And who doesn't like to do that? More oak trees. All right, so back in the car, it's been a good walk. Um, a little shorter than what I wanted to do this morning, but nonetheless, it was worth it. And um, this way I got to show you guys a little bit of Clear Lake and what it has to offer. Uh, I'm by no means an expert on this park or or even this city but uh, it gives you some idea of what's what's out here and um, but uh, but that's about it and um, and uh, hopefully we'll we'll be able to see some more of these parks and uh, also see what other parks have to offer well thanks for watching